Hello everyone, welcome back. And I'm currently sitting above our boot room. Behind me is our second attic, and that's above our kitchen and our cloakroom areas. Um, the reason I've come up here is we've got lots of materials lying around, um, some of which might be usable, some might not. And so I want to start sorting them out. But the reason I want to sort it out is we may end up having to pull up all these floorboards. They look a bit rotten to me and a lot of them have twisted. And, uh, you know, where they've dried and they've moved, they've just twisted. So we, we want to insulate um, the boot room ceiling. Uh, you've seen me doing that in the kitchen and the cloakroom area. Well, we want to do the same downstairs under here. But if we're going to have to pull up these boards, then it's sensible to pull the boards up first rather than get all the dust and dirt and uh, damage the plasterboard etc underneath so i want to have a proper look at these boards because they don't look too good to me the beams underneath i think are okay um they look pretty sound so i'm not worried about that the reason i've put these two boards down is just to give myself a little bit of confidence walking across this floor um so th this pile here on on my left that looks as though it's only going to be good for kindling, but it's quite a big pile. In that corner, there looks to be some usable wood. So I might as well sort that out and put that in my usable wood pile. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to start that process today, tidying it up, and then we can start to assess. There's no immediate panic now. We're too late uh, for this winter, so we're talking about next winter. So it's just one of those jobs. We're in a bit of a tidy up mood at the moment. Um, so we want to try and clear areas where there's just debris everywhere. And you never know what we might find here. We might find something interesting. Um, don't know. There's only one way of finding out. So let's work out what to get rid of and what not. Okay, well, something very interesting. Um, I've only been in here two minutes. I've got a load of cardboard, so that's going to be good for the potter's air. But what's really interesting, let's see if I can get over there. I've got to be a little bit careful. Get this out of the way. Do you remember a while ago we found two tiles up in our attic, just random tiles? Uh, we often wondered where they come from. Well, there's a pile of them here. Um, now ah, that's really exciting because the two odd ones, yeah, they were nice, but we couldn't really do a great deal with them. But there's quite a few here. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, whole pile of them there. Uh, I think these are different. These look plain, but this pile here. Yeah, perfect. Um, oh wow, that's really good. Okay, so that's that was worth coming up here for, just for those. So I'll get this into the potager for use uh, with our new beds. Um, I think before I go back up there, there's a lot of dust, so I'm going to put a mask on uh, just to be safe. 
Right. Well, the sun's breaking through now, so I thought I'd uh, get this charged up. Uh, this isn't the original power bank that I showed you uh, a few weeks ago. Um, All Powers, the company that sent me the other one, um, sent me this one as well, in addition, because I spoke about um, the need for a power source for my pump for the well. And the well pump that we've got is 500 watts, so they've sent me this 600 watt piece of kit. And it's really neat, really lightweight. I've got it with one finger. And that will give us all the power we need for our pump. And so that's something we're going to do this month to get that pump installed. Um, there's a wireless charger on the top for your phones. There's USBs there. There's two plug sockets. Um, we've been charging our phones with it and um, our uh, battery uh, batteries from our power tools. Uh, so it's been perfect and it doesn't take long to charge either. So give it a charge and um, yeah, that'll be full later today.
<laughs> okay, well, okay, I, I wasn't expecting that. Um, I knew there were some tiles there because they were poking up uh, from under that rubbish, but I'd looked at them previously and they were just these plain tiles, so I didn't really give them much thought, to be quite honest with you. Uh, I certainly didn't know we had these. Yeah, beautiful. And that one there, which I showed, obviously they had them in, you know, the triangular ones. There's quite a few triangular ones. Uh, there's this colour. It's a bit dirty, so we'd have to wash them. It looks more like this terracotta colour. And there's uh, a sort of grey. It may be grey. It may, be, it may turn out to be blue once we've cleaned them. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, well I wanted to clear that area, so now I've got a pile of tiles, but I I think we've got two options where we put these, so I'll go and get Susie first of all, because she's no idea what I've just done. <laughs> and in case you're wondering, I was the other side of there clearing those tiles. So, in fact, it was that corner there. Do you want to see what I've done? Yeah, okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, no, look at them all. I love these. We've got two in the kitchen. I thought that's all we had. Wow, I wonder yeah. where they were before. Well, I don't know. Look at this. So... Yeah, because we've got triangular ones square ones we've got two different colors mm. i can't quite tell the color they're so filthy but i think these look like a grayish color and then these look a bit darker almost this terracotta color shall we clean a couple up just to see yeah i think so okay. and i was wondering um if these could go in the tower room around the fireplace mm. and i know yeah. you, you're thinking about a splash back in the kitchen yeah, but I only had two and I was going to mix them with something. But um, I like the check tiles in the bathroom on the floor because some of them are broken. And also there's some round the fireplace in the tower room, which didn't really look right. No. Um, yeah, so should we clean mm. one or two, just have a proper look at oh, what Oh, I wonder are. if these were originally in the hallway because they've got a border. Yeah, maybe, maybe, but there's not many. Don't know. No. Um, I think we're running out of places to find anymore. So I was quite mm. The other thing is we've got a massive pile of these wooden slats. And I've just stacked them really easy because they're rotten. I'm wondering if they'll shred. I wonder why chip. they put them up there because they're a bit I useless, aren't they? Yeah. So I'm, I'm thinking, because these just snapped really easy, we could put those <coughs> in the chipper mm. if you want. Yeah. Um, so... That's a long-term thing. We don't have to do that straight away, but we'll need a load of chips and... Oh, and um, there's two bags of um, metal. <laughs> there's a horseshoe in here somewhere. What's this? I don't know what that is, actually. I've no idea. It's quite nice. Yeah. Uh... Oh, yeah. There you go, another horseshoe to add to the collection. So we might have a whole set. We might have a whole horse. <laughs> There's loads of metal, there's a bolts and... There's a, there's a load of horse leathers in the attic up there. Yeah. Well, there's quite a weight up there, all these tiles. And yeah. That floor's a little bit spongy, so I'm glad I've got them out. I don't know. I don't some, know. some of these things are a bit strange looking. Um, <laughs> a hook. Yeah. yeah, that must be a hook. I don't know what hooks onto it, but yeah. Well, we know what colour those are. Yeah. Hmm, that's a nice sort of burgundy colour. And grey. Actually, there are some burgundy ones as well, which I like. So that's quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, well, we've come up to the tower room and we'll show you this in more detail, the fireplace, but um, 
yeah, the, these might work in here. So what, what are your thoughts? Um, these red check tiles are the same as the ones in the bathroom. Yeah. And they don't, I don't know, they don't go. And they don't go with those bricks of there. So if we took all that out, maybe we could just tile that whole hearth in those. Yeah. And the, these are the two that I already had. Those are the ones we found up, that up I, above us in the other attic. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they look really nice. Nice colours. Yeah. Um, well, we could try to recreate this diagonal pattern yeah. in the hearth. And then... And you've got the border as well. Yeah. Uh, okay. I mean, they, they could have been from here. We don't know. Don't know. Because I don't think that is original. I think that would have been flat. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> okay, so we need to clean them all up, bring them all up here and mm. start thinking about how to do it. How yeah. to lay them all out. So that's a, a job for a rainy day. Get these up. There's... There's quite a few broken ones, actually. Yeah. Um, if we can get them out without breaking the rest. Yeah, OK. Well, it didn't quite make it to uh, 100%, but it's gone really overcast, so we can forgive it for that. It's about 75% now. Uh, but I was charging my phone with it at the same time as it was charging. So, yeah, it's a really nice piece of kit. And as I say, that's going to do our... Um, well water that will uh, operate our pump so uh thank you all powers it's uh, brilliant really pleased with that nice and neat little piece of kit yeah And that makes us feel just that little bit safer. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Some exciting finds again. Uh, thank you to everyone that's bought us coffees and things off our wish list. And welcome to our new subscribers. We had a few more. Yes, had a few more again. Thank you. And uh, big thanks to the patrons. Uh, thank you. Your support is invaluable to us. Uh, we did a video this week. Uh, just make sure you've got your notifications switched on because uh, not all of you have seen that video yet. Um, and there'll be another one this week for you. So, uh, yeah, thank you very like, much. Like and subscribe. <laughs> like and subscribe. Very, very important. So, if you would. Right. So, uh, right, I've got a bit of work to do. <laughs> yes. So, yeah. Thank you. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.